Last year, my agency pulled in over a million in revenue. I say that because it proves I know what it takes to consistently bring in new clients. When your business relies on a steady flow of leads, you get obsessed with what actually works. That's why I've spent the past year testing every AI lead generation automation out there. It's not just about chasing more leads, it's about staying ahead of everyone else in my space. And I'm not the only one pushing the limits. Inside my community, I'm swapping ideas with founders and agency owners who are just as relentless about scaling. We compare notes, call out what falls flat and double down on what's producing real results. Today, I'm breaking down the AI lead generation workflows that keep rising to the top. These are the ones making a real difference for me and for the people in my network. After running just about every automation you can think of, here's what's clear. Not every channel is worth your time and most of the AI workflows out there never deliver real results. But there are four channels where automation has genuinely changed the game for me and for the agency owners I work with. These are the ones that keep showing up over and over in business, in conversations with founders and in real results across my network. The ones are cold email, LinkedIn, YouTube and TikTok and meta ads. I'll break down each one, show you the kind of automations I'm using now and give you a look at how they actually fit into my lead generation process. Let's start with cold email because this is what my entire agency is built on. You're looking at two workflows on screen. If you've never seen something like this before, here's exactly what's going on. The top workflow is where it all begins. Whenever I want new leads, this system pulls fresh contacts straight from Apollo, which is basically the world's biggest database of business emails. So instead of spending hours or even days searching for decision makers, the workflow does it for me instantly. Once those leads are in, the second workflow takes over. Every contact gets checked to make sure they're actually a fit for what I'm offering. Then the system enriches leads with more details and finally uses AI to write a fully personalized sequence of emails for each person on that list. To put it simply, what used to take a full-time sales rep 15 or 20 minutes per lead minimum now happens automatically at scale. And because cold email is a numbers game, this means I'm reaching thousands of leads a day with every message personalized, so you get way more shots on goal without losing that personal touch. But let's be real about what it can and can't do. AI won't just write perfect emails on its own. You still need to build strong templates, set the direction and know your strategy. The AI's job is to take your proven framework and fill in the details that make people pay attention. So yes, cold email is still a skill and automation only multiplies what's already working. This exact setup is how I've landed over 50 clients myself and it's what I roll out for every client to get them dozens of new leads every month. If you want a real pipeline that brings in new business on autopilot, this is what actually works and this is how agencies scale past everyone who's still doing it by hand. If this sparked your curiosity and you're serious about automating your cold email, check out the link in the description. It'll take you straight to my school community. I'll help you build a fully automated cold outreach system in just 21 days. You'll get all my plug and play templates, the exact automations that scaled my agency to over $100,000 a month, and direct support from me and other operators already using these systems to book calls and land clients every single week. Even with all the work I put into my email templates and AI-driven personalization, not everyone is going to reply. That's just the reality of outreach. So here's what I do when someone ignores my email. This automation takes any lead who didn't reply to my cold outreach and gives them a second shot, this time on LinkedIn. It grabs their LinkedIn profile, then AI takes all those details we collected about the lead and writes a short unique message for each one. From there, another tool called Phantom Buster steps in to do the manual work for me. It sends out each connection request on LinkedIn using those custom messages and even follows up with leads automatically. The whole process runs in the background so I don't have to spend any extra time on it. But here's the catch with LinkedIn. Even with Sales Navigator, you're kept at around 250 connection requests per week. So unlike email, you can't just message everyone. You have to be very selective with your outreach. That's why I always put my most promising leads first. The automations make sure the people closest to my ideal customer profile add priority, meaning every request counts and I'm not wasting my limit on long shots. Over the last few months, this LinkedIn follow-up flow has pulled in dozens of leads who never replied to my cold emails. 
some of my best clients started with a single DM after ignoring three or four emails. That's why you want to reach out to people using more than one channel. LinkedIn has become a crucial part of my lead gen systems. It covers the gaps email can't reach, brings in replies I would have lost and does it all in the background while I focus on everything else. And that brings me to the next piece of my system content. If you run an agency and you're not posting content, you are losing ground. doesn't matter how strong your offer is. These days, trust is built before you ever get on a call. I personally learned this the hard way. The minute I started sharing even basic YouTube videos, breaking down my process, sales calls immediately picked up just from people watching a couple clips and reaching out. Content isn't about going viral. It's about showing real proof you can solve real problems. But let's be honest, Creating content for every platform is brutal if you do it by hand. Chopping up videos, hunting for the best bits, writing captions for each platform. It's a full-time job on top of running your business. Skip it and you leave money on the table. Try to do it all yourself and you burn out before you ever see results. That's why I automated the whole thing. With a tool called Vizard, my system takes any long-form video and turns it into a stack of short ready-to-post clips for TikToks reels and shorts. AI does all the heavy lifting, so finding highlights, adding captions, writing the hooks, then logs every clip in a Google Sheets content calendar. So now I always have a library of content ready to post without actually lifting a finger. This system is the only reason I can keep showing up everywhere, pull in leads from new channels and never worry about falling behind on content. So if you're still waiting for the right time to start posting or you're letting manual work slow you down, just know every week you wait, someone else is getting in front of your leads. Now, if you want to go beyond organic channels and scale your results fast, you need to start buying attention. And that is where paid ads come in. Buying attention is the next step in my agency journey. After years of doing this manually for my own e-commerce brands, I learned firsthand how relentless ads can be the constant testing, the daily monitoring, and the endless creative tweaks. If you try to keep up by hand, it is very, very time consuming. But if your offer is strong and you've built real trust online, meta ads are the ultimate amplifier. The ROI can get really crazy. I've watched founders double their revenue in just a few months by finally cracking paid ads. I wanted to automate the parts of the process that eat up the most time. So my system now tracks all campaigns pulls in fresh performance data from Meta and uses AI to figure out which ads and scripts are actually working. It digs deep for product research, spins up new ad angles and generates fresh scripts, keeping everything organized inside Airtable. Every week, I know which ads are working and where my spend is actually paying off. If I need new creative angles, I can generate them with one click. New campaign scripts are ready almost instantly. I still make the final calls and I'm always tweaking what goes live, but the grunt work is finally off my plate. That said, this isn't a silver bullet and ads are very complex. Even the best automation needs oversight. Not every script or angle hits and performance can swing very fast day to day. I'm still in the early days with this setup and I will be testing and improving it over the next few months. But even now, the time saved and the results so far have been a massive step forward. So those are the four lead gen automations I'm running right now and the system I rely on to keep the pipeline moving in 2025. From cold email to LinkedIn to short form content and paid ads, these are what actually drive results. If you're interested in learning more about automating your cold outreach, but you're not ready to dive into the full community just yet, you can check out the video popping up on screen right now, where I walk you through building a cold email automation from scratch in under 12 minutes. I'll give you a real sense of how these systems work and how you can get started yourself. I want to thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.